Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I want to talk about something very, very important. Something that's not being taught to kids, Muslims. The fiqh of jihad fi sabilillah. It's as if we're afraid of the word. Truly. But because this has been left out of the curriculum, you have Muslims today making statements of kufr. They are lying against the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, lying against the Rashidun Caliphate, lying against the Book of Allah. And I want to make this fast, so I'm not going to go too deep into it. But Muslims don't even know that there is such thing as offensive jihad. They don't understand that. There's offensive and defensive. And the fiqh behind both. And the reasoning behind both. We can all understand the reason for defensive. But... The offensive. What is the reasoning for that? We have it directly from the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and from the Rashidun Caliphate, the rightly guided caliphate. Why did they go into other lands that did not attack them first? Because the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, this religion is a mercy to all of mankind. But how do we get all of mankind to see the mercy and feel the mercy? Through Sharia, through the Sharia of Allah, give victory to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Put his law, his legislation active on earth and you will see the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And all those lands that were opened up by the Muslims are Muslim today, not by forced conversion, but because they saw the mercy of Islam and the justice of Islam. But this is a long, long subject and we should have classes on it by educated people in the field. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.